it is Veda Day 19, and today is about reading and books. Our prompt from Bat and Veda is, we know you love video, but what about books? Do you enjoy reading? What is your all-time favorite book? What is it that you love about reading? So, he likes reading. <laughs> he likes reading. I probably don't read as much as I should. Um, when I was younger, that's all I used to want to do is, is read. Read, 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 read. But, I don't know, as you get older, life kind of gets in the way, I guess. Um, now I kind of go through long periods of time where I read or I don't read. I get the bug and then I lose it for a while. And I'm, I'm, I'm actually, I'm, a, I'm on a not read period. I'm probably overdue for a switch. I'm sure it'll happen soon. Um, but... What I read now tends to be uh, electronic on my Kindle or on my iPad. I like all of this, but when it comes to fiction and things that I probably won't read more than once, I kind of feel like this kind of stuff is a waste. Um, it's more environmentally sound, though. <laughs> though sometimes you like just having that book, the smell of the book, the feel of the book. Um, and if it's something that I end up really, really liking, really liking, then I will buy a, a hardcover copy of it and put it on my shelf here and enjoy it at a future time because I know it's something that I'll keep reading. So what's on my shelves? What's on my shelves? Not a lot of fiction. Most of the fiction is right behind me here. And this one is probably my favorite book of all time, In Review with a Vampire. I love this series, and Anne Rice has a new one coming out in October concerning Lestat, Prince Lestat, and I cannot wait for that one. Um. Um, but not a lot. I admit to being a Twilight lover. I admit to being a Harry Potter uh, fan. So, past that, what's on these shelves? A lot of cookbooks. And that way, there's a whole lot of reference books concerning geek garb, like Star Wars and Lord of the Rings. I'll put a picture right here. And I, I enjoy a lot of those kind of reference books, the kind of uh, books that you want a hardcover copy of so you can look at the pretty pictures, so to speak. Um, sometimes things like that get lost in the electronic versions. And... The other things that I like having hard copies of that are reference also has a lot to do with castles and Stonehenge and Italy and Ireland. I'll put a picture of those up here. Those are that way. And what else? What else do I have here? Oh, I have books on carnival glass that are right up here. You can't see them. I'll put another picture. That's something that I collect. So a lot of reference books I will do in hardcover. Um, those are crochet books right there. But if it's a fiction book, I've really, really got to like it to buy it. And if I do, it will be in hardcover. I don't like soft covers. I don't know. I'm kind of OCD with the books that I do have. I don't like it when the pages or the, uh, the cover in particular kind of gets all messed up from use. Uh, a lot of people like that where they can like take the top and like fold it over and that, that, I don't know, I'm a little too OCD for that. So I tend to get hard covers. But that's really it. Other than that, I will mention that these shelves, <laughs> this, this, this is a, a book girl joke. <laughs> and I think I actually have um, a picture of this joke on my Pinterest <laughs> under the LOL board. 
and uh, it goes something like this. All a bookworm really wants, all a book girl really wants, is a man who will build her bookshelves. My husband built these bookshelves, so he wins. <laughs> all right. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.